What is going on everyone? Welcome back to the LFC Transfer Room YouTube channel. I'm standing up today because we're going for a different vibe and today we're going to be talking about one man, Mr. Jack Grealish. Now before we get into this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We're so close to 650 subscribers, so let's go get it. So recent reports have been linking Liverpool for a potential move for Jack Grealish in the summer if one of the front three leaves. So this season, Jack Grealish has got 10 assists and 6 goals in 22 matches. 16 goals and assists in 22 matches, which means he's averaging around a goal and assist 3 out of 4 games. His influence has obviously helped Aston Villa fly up the table this season and I, they could actually finish above Liverpool this season. So why would Jack Grealish want to come to Liverpool and would he fit in? For me, he would. I think he plays a bit like Felipe Coutinho when he used to come in off the left and curl in to the top bins. Obviously, he's a completely different type of player to what we know, but his end product and the way that he plays football is so naturally delightful. And he's probably, barring Haaland and Mbappe, my personal third biggest signing that we could make. But coming with that comes a little bit of a fee. The predicted fee that people would think it would cost Liverpool would be between 80 and 100 million pounds. And to be honest, Jack Grealish is worth that money. Now, whether Liverpool fans think he is, that's another matter. But I personally do. I would 100% pay that money. Another factor coming into it is whether Grealish would actually leave Aston Villa at all. Now, you could argue that the two times that he could have left Villa were one, when they got relegated back in 2016, and two, when they lost in the playoff final in 2018, actually on the same day as Liverpool lost to Real Madrid in the 2018 Champions League final. He's always com been committed to Villa, and potentially, he could have gone to Manchester United or Arsenal previously. He also may prove a disciplinary problem for Jurgen Klopp, and he doesn't like these sort of players. He's already been charged for drink driving, uh, amongst other things, so maybe Klopp wouldn't enjoy that. So my final assessment is, if we can get Jack Grealish, go get him. Do I think we will? Nah. Thank you very much for watching, everyone, and I hope you enjoyed this new high-energy style, me standing up, talking about football. Uh, we've got another unbelievable couple of weeks ahead for the transfer room, so make sure you're here and stay tuned for that. And yeah, subscribe, and I'll see you in a bit.